To report when speed, please go through the towel method, time, event, and location. Now for the time, we want to know when the wind gust occurred. We can usually match this up using radar images, so an estimate of a time of occurrence is okay. For the event, we want to know what the wind speed was. You should include how the wind speed was measured or estimated in your report. Did you use the Beaufort scale to estimate it, or did you use an anemometer, which is an instrument that is displayed at right through your personal weather station? And finally, the location where you observed the wind speed. An intersection or the address is fine because you are usually going to be underneath or near the strong wind when it hits. One other thing we want to emphasize with wind speed is that sometimes we overestimate the speed of wind that we observe, most likely because we just don't often see 40 mile per hour winds, and so they seem really fast. As a result, we're trying to push the use of the so-called Beaufort scale, which you can see at right in the slide there, which matches a range of wind to threshold of visible damage that you might see. As we are receiving a wind report, we will be checking to see if the wind speed you provided matches the damage you noticed. For example, if you report a 75 mile per hour wind gust, but it only knocked down thin twigs to the ground, well, we're going to question that report. In addition, we want you to abstain from using the wind speeds, which will be cited in our warnings or our special weather statements, as you reported wind speed. Those wind speeds are often just the first educated guess on our part, and so the wind speed could be wrong. Now watch this video of a gusty wind scenario. This is often misreported as 60 to 70 mile per hour winds, but it is really only 30 to 50 miles per hour. This would really only drop twigs and small tree branches as opposed to start to create structural damage. Now compare that previous video to this one here. This is really more representative of 60 to 70 mile per hour winds. Oh my god! Notice how little visibility you have and how branches are blowing a lot stronger now.